everybody, MechFrog here. Today we have a very special package from Turbo Dork. We're going to open it up here on video, and it'll be your time, your first time seeing some of these paints, and definitely my first time seeing some of these paints. Uh, so some of them are from their new line. Some are ones that I picked out and thought that uh, might look good on various models. So we'll give them a try here. Um, Turbo Dork people were very gracious to send these to me. Um, uh, someone there was a fan of fan of the work that I've done, and uh, they wanted to see uh, see what I could do with their new paints. So we're gonna check these out. Right. What do we got here. Up. So we have summoning sickness. A metallic green. Awesome. An orangey glad. Metallic orange. So each one of these has kind of instructions here as how they uh, how they suggest you use it. So in this case, for most vibrant results, apply over orange undercoat. Paint three to five thin layers with airbrush or hand brush. So each one of these is uh, gonna have a little different suggestion there. Romeo and Juliet. It'd be fun to do a house Merrick mech and uh, Romeo and Juliet here. Or black, white, or white to black Xenothal. Wow, okay. That might be fun. Set these aside here. I'm excited and waiting, waiting a while for this to show up. Dork. Oh, it's a paint for me. Finally, I'm represented in a paint. Nice. Over 15 minutes of fame. There you go. Faye Wilds. Oh, it's a definitely color shift there, or turbo shift, I guess, is the ter term they use. Super excited. I've got a bunch of mechs here that are going to be, they're waiting for primer. I'm going to do some testing here in uh, some videos in the, in the coming days. Turbo. Good. Another bag. Another bag. Another bag of joy here. Oh, we got some cool stickers. Oh, I think I know. I think I know exactly where that's going to go. It's probably going to go right here on my blue work pad. That here. Card. The side. Got cold open. Good. That will look. Like, oh, that's an awesome. Card. Just looking at these, full of ideas for what to do for Max. And even Space Marines and other other stuff. Apple seed. I like apple seed a lot. The metallic green. You know, picture a Space Marine in this metallic green. That'd be really cool. Very chromey. Galaxia. Purplish turbo shift. Neat. Hotline. Metallic pink. Got Siberia. Some blue. Just interesting because the from the looks inside it looks white. So I'm interested in what how the well this goes over. So it goes uh, so make sure tip is clear. Must be applied over black undercoat. And so painting painting these is going to be interesting because I can't just prime all these the same color and go to town. Some of them have to be black. Some have to be white. Some of them they suggest doing zenithal. So it's going to be interesting. Hemo Goblin. I saw this one. This one looked really cool for uh, Salamander Space Marines. So to do their shoulder pads in this would be neat. So pick that one out. Here, one last bag. Get going here. Radium. This is the one for this is I think this is an older one, not from their new line, but I picked this out now, I think. 
just that that metallic not quite gold it's got uh, gold but with a tint of green to it so appropriate name there for the radium I actually had uh, I had one of those watches that had the little glowing radium dials on it um, if you're a fan of history you know those were popular for a while when, uh, until the, the uh, women who were employed painting the little hands on the clocks uh, started getting sick from the radium that they were consuming when they licked the brushes. Bad times. Uh, Twin Suns. Another cool one. Blue blue to green shift. Let's see, this is going to be over black. Black, white, or white to black xenophone. Okay, so I might have to t I might have to do a couple of tests for for some of these that have multiple suggestions. Life on Mars. Picked this one out because, of course, I'm a Admech fanboy. So to have a nice metallic red, dark, dark red, would be cool. Let's see what we need for this one. Probably black, I would guess. Apply over black undercoat. No. Nope. Do that. All right, last one. Prism Power. Another cool one. Almost like an orangish to blue. We'll see. Kind of part of the fun of the Turbo Dark paints is you never quite know what you're going to get until you try it out. Oh, really cool. I'm looking forward to put working with these in the next, uh, in the coming days and weeks. It'll be very likely some mechs of the day that uh, employ these colors. Um, so until then, I, I should probably get to work. So before I let you go, I want to say one more thank you to Turbo Dork for sending these cool paints. Uh, I will do my best to, to make them look good. Um, for the rest of you, take care, be awesome, make the world a slightly better place today and tomorrow.